Raheem's second week of pre-seasons now behind us. How are you finding it in Worcester so far? Uh, pretty good, adjusting to the lifestyle here and uh, just the town. I've been here a couple of times, but, but I've got a different perspective now that I'm, I'm here for, for, for the season anyway. So uh, it's, it's good. We, we haven't got everyone in, but we're gelling with what we do have. And two weeks of practice. The first week was definitely... Um, Definitely tiring, as, as, as expected to yeah. be anyway. As, as, yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. The legs are shot, but uh, I think we all, we all handled the first week pretty well and looking, looking forward to, to where we can take this. Obviously, pre season starts against Newcastle away. Um, what are your thoughts going to that game? Um, it's interesting. It's, a, it's a, great a great first test to have, of course. I mean, Newcastle, one of the, one of the best teams, yeah. one of the better teams in the league for sure. So it's a good way to test, test our abilities. and. We're not we're not fully we're not fully here yet in terms of all our players, so yeah. we're still under men, but it's definitely it'll be nice to go out play against some different faces other than the ones just in practice. So hopefully it'll get us yeah. in in the right direction for this season. Obviously, you return to the BBL with all this season. You, you, you could almost be classed as a BBL veteran now, <laughs> not saying you're old. <laughs> but um, how do you feel the league sort of evolved over the years? Um, it's definitely every year it's getting more competitive. Obviously, I started the first professional team I played with was uh, Leicester, and that year it was kind of it was very less. We, we were very strong, and it was it was kind of one-sided yeah. even and made almost to predictable. take. Yeah, yeah, it was very predictable. Whereas the last few years. Um, a lot of teams, it's not that Leicester have gone backwards, it's just the other teams have stepped their game up and yeah. everyone's catching up now. And as you see, look, last year, Lon London, the Lions, they won the league. Um, uh, we had the introduction of Royals, who for the first season got silverware, made it to the playoff final. Yeah. So that just that speaks for itself in the terms of how competitive the league's going. And even some of the other teams that would weren't weren't notoriously known to to be great for example manchester lots yeah. of teams have have really just stepped their game up so on the whole the the whole league is it's not it's not it's not as predictable as what it used to be before you could maybe i'd say three years ago you could tell who was going to win the game before yeah. the game now you can't really every game is is a scrap and yeah. and and something up for grabs every game well thanks for time Rahim. we'll speak to you again soon definitely thank Cheers. you very much thank you. see you